Hi guys, welcome to another lesson. It's been a long time. How have you been? Uh, today we have a very special song, one of my favorite songs by Adele, uh, originally by Bob Dylan, Make You Feel My Love. Um, really, really gorgeous song. Uh, great ballad. Usually ballad and violin go hand in hand together very nicely. Okay, so without further ado, let's go to the sheet music right there. As you can see, the fingerings are written in red. Uh, if it, uh, the fingerings are low, uh, they're indicated by uh, uh, the light blue arrow down. Okay, so if you don't see an arrow on certain fingering, that means on the tape. So these are the tape one, two, three, four. Okay, this is regular one, low one, two, low two, three, low three, four, low four. Okay, got that? Okay, let's go over the first two lines. There's a dotted rhythm, so watch out for that. Okay, that was first three line. Anyway. Okay, so one thing I want you to make a note on first three line is you want to fade after each phrase, like this. Fade. And then even though these are uh, eight notes, make sure you move that bow. Remember we talked about minimum speed on the bow? It's not this. It's more flowing movement of the bow. See, I keep it moving. Yeah. And I'm not really pressing a lot on the strings, so more pressure, uh, less uh, fluid it will be. So on this, like a pop bird song, I let the bow kind of flow, kind of glide on the bow. So it's like this kind of bowing. Instead of this bowing. Get it? And then you fade at the end. All right. Let's go to chorus. It says there, um, low one there. When you do two E two to uh, G two, make sure you kind of like slide over. Don't do E two and then lift your finger and then do the G two. Okay, so. Also, I want to make sure that uh, you guys prepare for the next note. So when I do A low one, I have the zero there, and then I prepare my D three, yeah, and then I prepare my low one. So okay, earlier preparation equals better playing, okay. And that wasn't so good. Let me try it again. Got it? Okay. Let me play the chorus one more time. Moving on to second page, D low two, and going to D low one. Okay. Okay, second line one more time. That G low two to four, it's quite a stretch, so make sure. Uh, stretch out for that. A lot of time when you do low, uh, your finger kind of get dragged underneath with the low because this is two and then when you go to four, it's fine. But when you go for G low two to four, eh, 
becomes kind of like this, so I'll make sure to check that tape. Okay, third line. Do you see me stretch out for that there? So G low two. Next part is instrumental. Uh, I found it on Adele's video. Uh, you can choose to do it, not to do it, but it's fun to do it. Gonna play along with the video. It's nice. It's a little complicated, uh, but it's not that complicated. You just after the D, you kind of make the kind of scale with the low two and the low one. And then you end on the A three there, and then low two, and then low one, and then low one to low two, and then here comes the first uh, low three. Low three is three is here. Low three is here. Low three, low two, low one, and then low three again on the D string, and then low two. Now regular two, regular three, three to low one on the A string. Okay, you got it. If you have questions, just take a look at that again. All right. Now. Going to the final stretch, I thought that it'd be better, uh, more interesting to play it octave higher. So here we go, E low four. This is regular four, E low four. Let's have the three and the low four together. It's low one to low, low one, low one. Yeah, E low one to A low one. So again, you, you see the E low one to A low one a lot, right? Coming right after each other. So I will uh, bridge that. So when I put down the E low one, I'll put down the A low one too. Yeah. So that this is at the last uh, notes on the, this page. So instead of doing this, it's this. Alrighty. All right. Final page. So it's kind of difficult when you go have to go from low one to low four, but uh, make sure that you know it's not here. It's actually here, okay? The low four there. Okay, seven line. That's the end of the song. Um, just to recap, make sure the bow is flowing like this. Uh, don't let the low fingering trap the regular fingering down. Um, and then add vibrato and make sure you fade. And then you will make this song sound very beautiful. Alright, until next time, thank you for watching. Uh, please like and subscribe and 